We head to Ryde, a northwest suburb of Sydney. Bessie is with Robert from Cape Cod for a tour of this recently renovated home where old meets new. Here we are. This is great. Yeah. So this is the existing yes. build yeah. and this is the redo. Yeah, the only impact on downstairs was really where the stair came, came through. Yeah. We actually moved a wall back to create a small study area, but really that's the stairs going up to something quite special. It's yeah. great. I can't wait to see upstairs. Perfect. Let's do it. Awesome. Rob, you're walking upstairs and I had no idea of the surprise that was awaiting us. This is cool. I know, it's special, isn't it? It's it really is, special. Yeah, it's something that the client's been dreaming about. They wanted a motel style room yeah. and that's what we've been able to deliver. I'll touch on the fact that this is a rebuild. You guys do rebuilds and you specialise in it. Yeah. The house was a certain way on one floor and you've created and duplicated this second floor to look sure. really the same. It's seamless. Absolutely. So, which is really what, one of the things that we try our best to specialise in. Mm -hmm. And it's about introducing similar um, finishes to the timber work, to the cornices, yeah. to the ceilings. This is a 40s, 50s style where they often did a curved brick red texture brick wall down down the bottom yeah. um, with the timber windows and we were able to replicate that upstairs um, in the curves which means that looking from the outside as you could see it's, you could hardly pick it as an extension which is really what we're looking to achieve. So they've been here a week is that right? Um, yeah they only moved upstairs last week. Wow so um, what's the verdict? So, what are they saying? So oh, they're like, I mean, she's <laughs> just escaping up here. Um, yeah. I think she said to us this morning she sort of gets upstairs by about 8.30 and uh, awesome. gets her husband to finish things off downstairs while she just gets a little quiet in space. It seems like a dream to have yeah. your um, parents' area in your bedroom and then have this lush kind of wet room at the back. And it's yeah. such a beautiful and bright and light space. I love the choice of tiles. It's really reflecting even more light in here. Yeah, that's right. The tiles and the, and, the, and the mirrors and the light kinds that they've chosen. But certainly um, there's plenty of um, ventilation from the highlight windows as well. Mm -hmm. So you get a great cross breeze, um, but light coming in. But yeah, that no, really is bright. This was a client that really knew what they wanted yeah. in relation to yeah. vanities and taps. And we were able to help them um, decide what they wanted, but they made the ultimate choice. And often that's the way with the alterations and additions as well. This is a one-off that people say, I need to go out and choose. So, you know, we can help them in that process. What were the challenges with this with this build? Well, certainly the curved walls. Yeah. Um, as yeah, because it, it's not something that's done all the time. Yeah. Um, so it's hard, yeah. so that, that's come up really well. Um, the wall itself is not that that difficult, but certainly when it comes to cornices and skirtings, getting it to just flow. Um, so that was certainly a challenge. Mm -hmm. um, the rest of it was you know, for what we do, fairly straightforward. The staircase is gorgeous too, so when you came to the clients and said, look, we can do this and, and this is what we want to do, we want to put the staircase here, yeah. you've created a little side room that was originally, um, I think, one of the kids' bedrooms. We try and find a location that's obviously going to work for the upstairs yeah. and get to use the space that's left, so we've got to get it to work for the upstairs and downstairs. So this room in particular, is it energy efficient? Absolutely. Right. I mean, it's something that we actually do as standard. It's all about the glazing. It's all about what we use on the walls, um, the cavity builds that we create, even though they're timber frames, mm -hmm. um, and ventilation systems. So it does really make a difference to the comfortability of the client. So we've met you a few times, Rob, and I'm blown away each and every time you take me to yeah. another home. You do such a great job. But what are the different ranges that you do? You seem to do it all. Well, what we do is probably around the $150,000 mark up to the $2 million plus mark. But really, alteration, it is what the people are looking for. So yeah. it might start from a small deck, but yeah, we, we certainly do larger rooms and then full makeovers. How long did it take the process? Um, probably about 16 to 18 wow. weeks. Finally prize, how do we go? Yeah, look, it's around $350,000 budget yeah. for this one. I've got to tell you, it's not a yeah. huge investment. It's not a huge amount of time either. And this kind of asset at the end is awesome. Yeah. What a great result. Yeah, it certainly is. Rob, you guys have done a fantastic job. Cape Cod is just bringing out the goods and we can't wait to see you next time. Terrific, thank you. The great thing about renovating is you can get exactly what you need and want in a home. The builders here have listened carefully to the owners and turned their ideas and dreams into reality.